Hello everyone and welcome to today's discussion on critical thinking. Critical thinking is a vital skill that allows us to analyze and evaluate information, ideas, and arguments in a logical and rational manner. In this section, we'll delve into what critical thinking is, why it's important, and provide you with some practical examples to illustrate its application in real life. So let's start by defining critical thinking. Critical thinking is ability to objectively assess, analyze, and synthesize information before forming conclusions or making decisions. It involves looking beyond the surface level of things and considering different perspectives, evidence, and implications. Critical thinking is about question, questioning assumptions, recognizing biases, and understanding the logical connections between ideas. Let's take a simple example to illustrate, uh, illustrate this. Imagine you uh, you presented with a news article claiming that a new miracle product can help you lose, lose 10 pounds in a week without any exercise or diet changes. A critical thinker wouldn't, uh, wouldn't uh, just accept this claim at face value. They would, uh, would question how such a result is possible and whether there is a credibility, scientific evidence to support it. Critical thinkers are often skeptical, but their skepticism is grounded in a desire for, in a desire for evidence-based reasoning. Another aspect of critical thinking is the ability to identify logical fallacies. These are errors in reasoning that can weaken an argument. For example, the appeal to authority fallacy involves accepting a claim simply because someone in authority says it's true. A critical thinker would recognize this fallacy and instead seek out uh, supporting evidence. Let's consider an everyday scenario, purchasing a new smartphone without critical thinking. You might be swayed by flashy advertisements that boast the phone's uh, superiority. However, a critical thinker would research beyond the ads, comparing features, reading reviews, and considering their personal needs before making an informed decision. Critical thinking also involves being open to changing your mind in the face of new evidence. Imagine you are in a debate about a social issue. A critical thinker wouldn't cling to, to their in initial position, even if compelling evidence emerges that contradicts uh, their view. They would adjust their stance based on the strength of the evidence. And let's not forget about problem solving. Critical thinking plays a crucial role in approaching complex problems. For instance, let's say you are facing a challenge at work where the conventional solutions don't seem to be effective. Instead of giving up, a critical thinker would brainstorm creative alternatives, assess their feasibility, and adapt their approach as needed. Critical thinking is not only about dissecting arguments, but also about constructing sound ones. In discussions, a critical thinker would provide well reasoned explanations and support their claims with evidence rather than resorting to emotional appeals or vague, uh, vague uh, statements. To sum it up, Critical thinking is an essential skill for navigating the complexity, uh, complexities of the modern world. It empowers us to make informed decisions, solve problems effectively, and engage in thoughtful dis discussions. Remember, it's not about being critical for the sake of it.
but about being discerning and thoughtful in our approach to information and ideas. Thank you everyone for joining this uh, enlightening discussion on critical thinking. Remember to challenge assumptions, seek evidence, and embrace the power of rational thought in your daily life. In the next lesson, we'll talk about strategic thinking.